so my chicks have definitely figured out what my red bucket means. And when I come anywhere with my red bucket, you can bet that they're coming too. Because it means that the mealworms are out. And I actually got a mix of this kind that has mealworms and beetles and flies. But they have gotten so good at eating it out of my hand to the point that they really do fight over it. I wish that I had like five hands. They do bite me sometimes, but it never really hurts. Um, but I try to get two hands going at once so that we can all have some. They haven't really figured that part out yet. But I fill this whole part of this container full and try to have it ready for them and going. Um, this is their treat in the middle of the day. It makes it so they can be a little bit lazier and don't have to scavenge all day. I'm just coming back with more babies. It's okay. Yeah, stop biting my fingers. It's okay. Just get the buggies. Yeah, but it makes it so their day is a little bit better and they can be lazier throughout the day. Um, it is hot. We don't like it when it's hot. You can see it. They pant. They're just like us. They got feathers. They don't enjoy it. They're lazy. You can see it on my big bird, um, my bigger chickens. My one is actually, her back is not well, just because she's lazy and she doesn't run from the rooster like she should. But, so there's my babies. Definitely a big difference from the second time that they had mealworms that I showed you. Um, they are figuring it out. I always leave them with some to scavenge for. They're starting to be talkers. They talk at me every time. But they definitely love their treats. Hello, my chicken sense friends. It is the 15th day of inspirational July and my quote for the day is Lord help me be the person my chickens think I am. So I love this quote and my mom was so sweet she thought of me when she was out shopping and she got me this cute little tray that says my chickens think that I'm amazing. So it goes along really well with my quote today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video of my pullets eating their mealworms. They have gotten um, quite feisty as they're eating them, that's for sure. But I'm gonna talk a little bit about um, why I hope that um, I am the person that, that my chickens think I am. Because obviously I am their caretaker. I'm the one that feeds them every day. I let them out, I put them in at night. Well, they put themselves in, but I close the door and lock them and keep them safe from predators and all that. Um, I do try my best to live my life as good as I can to do right by others. Um, my husband jokes with me and says, if you would only treat me as good as you treat your chickens. Well, um, he's a farmer and he's been having some allergy problems lately. And um, on top of it, he has to clean out grain bins and do things like that. And so since he has a diffuser, and so um, I have the deluxe diffuser and it's awesome. It has like eight different colors that it comes in and I love the light blue. Um, after this video, I'm just going to show a short clip of it. Um, it is beautiful. I love it. It has little flowers on the thing. It is really cute. And the reason I like this diffuser, I have had my fair share of diffusers. Excuse Jimmy in the background. Um, but I've had my fair share of diffusers. And this one, where it holds the water, is a lot bigger than most diffusers. So it lasts a lot longer. Um, I do put a little bit more oil in it than I do most diffusers just because it has more water. And so it just makes sense for me to put more drops in. Um, but since he's been having these problems, I went to my eucalyptus, eucalyptus lavender mint, and I've been diffusing this um, the last two nights as he's gone to bed. And he has woken, woken up so happy. Um, he woke up yesterday and he didn't realize I was diffusing this. He didn't know what happened. He's like, I woke up and I feel awesome. He's like, my cough is gone, my sniffles are gone, I don't know what's going on. And I explained to him, like, honey, I plugged in our diffuser last night. 
I got it going for the first time and I use this eucalyptus lavender mint. He's like, oh. So when we went to bed last night, he's like, make sure you're turning the diffuser on. And so, um, you know, I do take care of my family as well as I take care of my chickens. Um, and I try my best to treat my friends and my extended family well as well. Um, I really do do for others. I try to make that the motto of my life and I try to teach my children that as well. Is um, I truly do believe in karma, is that it doesn't come around from the same person, but that if you do well to others, that others are gonna eventually do well to you. And um, while I haven't always seen direct effects of that, I do believe that that will be the ultimate income outcome of my life. So um, I hope that that resonates with you in some way, shape or form because I do believe there are a lot of people out there like that. Um, everyone talks about people being so negative and cold. And I do believe there are a lot of people out there like me that have the same outlook on life and that um, we just don't speak up enough. That it's those negative Nancys that are always the ones that are out voicing their opinion. And so we see all the negative and we don't get to hear the positive. So um, let's, let's, let's let us positive um, people have a voice too and um, let's just do good for others and pass on the kindness and pay it forward and I'm sure that one day it'll come back to full so I hope you guys are having a great day and I will talk to you all tomorrow